All right, first off, I want to say all praises to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Yahweh is the true name of the Father. Yahweh Shai, the true name of the Son. Double honors to the leaders of Israel right now, who are the apostles and elders of James, from the Apostle Tahar, Apostle Gabar, Apostle Rhymelab, and down. Much salutations to the um, Akim out there pushing this word in sincerity and in truth, who have the faith of our Lord Yahweh Shai, Mashiach. You know, and salutations also to the, the sisters, the believers, you know, the helps who also have the faith, you know, who listen and tune in, you know, to the gospel. Now, um, this is going to be an RFID microchip update for the system of the, of the chip. Here in Jamaica, we have um, what's called the National Identification System or the National Identification Card, which is currently being, um, currently being, um, Constructed, the system is currently being constructed. They plan to um, implement it fully by 2019. You know, it was 2018, but they pushed it back because of some, um, you know, some setbacks. But you know, this is just to show you that um, the RFID, the National Identification System, is a precursor to the um, to the RFID microchip system that's a, that's going to be implemented according to Revelation 13 verse 16. Now, without further ado, let's get into it. This is from the Gleaner, the Jamaica Gleaner, and was published Friday, September 8, 2017. So that was um, before the weekend. It says, no ID, no access. Jamaicans will need national identification card to access government goods and services. Now, this is exactly what the, um, the RFID, this is one of the, the main reasons why the RFID microchip will be implemented to control access to goods and services within the system, right? Without that, that, um, that, that chip that has you, you know, pegged into the system, you will not be a part of society. And, and have, having that national identification card is a way of the government tracking your, 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 um, your, your transactions and your, your everyday activities, right? So it says, under the government's proposed national identification system, Jamaicans without a national identification card will not be able to do business with the government, with government agencies and departments when it is rolled out in 2019. Additionally, persons without the national ID may also face serious challenges as they seek to do business with the private sector. Right? So let's just get into the, um, the precept to see how this links up. I'll, I'll you know, post the, um, the article for the brothers who wants to read the entire bit. So this is Revelation chapter 13 and verse 16, and he calls it all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a right hand a, a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Now we see how the national identification system, which just just for the brothers who don't know, the NIDS system or the NIDS card aims to capture all your biometric information, your financial information, as well as your tax information and your um, your IDs like your um, your driver's license. I'm not sure if they're going to implement or infuse the, the, the passport within the, NI, the, NID, the NIC, but I know your, um, your driver's license, your TRN, your um, your voter's ID, your, your, your bank information, credit and debit cards, and your um, debit cards, I'm not sure about credit cards, debit cards debit card information and your biometric information like your fingerprints your um your iris scan you know stuff like that so it says without it says jamaicans without a national identification card or nic will be unable to do business with the government agencies and and departments when it is rolled out in 2019 serious challenges may all additionally persons without the national id may also face serious challenges as they seek to do business with the private sector all right so it's showing you that without the NIDS card, you won't be able to what buy or sell, right? And then when that evolves now into the microchip, which is which is what you're going to f physically implant in you, right? That's going to take on the same role. You know, without it, you won't be able to, to to do business with the government and with the private sector, right? So this is exactly what the precept is talking about when he says, and he calls it all about small and great, rich and poor, free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark or the number of the name or the or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Now I'm not saying, just to clarify for, for 
stupid niggas out there. We're not, we're not saying, or I am not saying, that the National Identification Card is the mark of the beast. It is a precursor, meaning it is a, a step towards the RFID um, technology system. Because having all of this information on a, on a card with a microchip in it, the next step would be to implement that microchip directly, physically, into your body. Right, whether it be your right hand or your or, or your or your left hand or your right cheek or your left cheek or your forehead, you know, it's talking about the same mark of the beast, which is spoken of in Revelation 13, chapter 16. Now, as a side note, the ISUPK is outwardly pushing that the R, the mark of the beast is not the RFID chip technology. They are teaching that the Christianity is the mark of the beast and telling israelites that it is not a, it is not wrong to take the rfid chip all right simply put they are leading jake to the slaughter all right they are deceiving our people all right and by telling lies to our people that should are showing that you hate your people yo and let's just bring out a precept for that just to show exactly what these men are doing yo this is first john 3 and 15 whosoever hated his brother is a murderer and ye know that no murderer has eternal life abiding in him icupk are straight up murderers yo iuic are straight up murderers all right because they have they have sold out to the so-called white man you know to get their gift you know to 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 to, to get their um what you call that now to get their 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 five hundred one C three charter so that they can they, they can be a part of the system, yo. They have taken Judas purse, you know, so to speak. So they hate their brethren, yo, and they are murderers, right? For telling for telling uh, for preaching out there that it's not wrong to take the RFID chip, which is the mark of the beast, yo. Right? They are false prophets. They are murderers, yo. Right? So I mean, we, I don't have to go on and rant about it anymore all right just to, to 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 update you brothers about what's going on here in um in jamaica with it you know i'm going to post the article so other brothers can read it you know but basically the gist is without the um the nids card you won't be able to do any transactions with the government and i said also you know with the private sector because they're also they're, they're going to force the private sector to come on board to to to, to um to 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 insist that persons have their um their their national id card because right now without your trn which is your tax registration number even private sector businesses ask for your trn number when you're going to make a bank account or you're going to take a loan you know stuff like that you need your trn if you're going to take out a mortgage you know car insurance you're going to buy a car everything needs your tax registration number so this is the same same idea you know with the nids card you know, so with that, you know, I hope this was edifying to elect. And again, Kalalal Yehawabah Shemi Shai and double honors to the apostles of GMS. You know, salutations to the Akim. You know, much love. Shalom.